John Morrison. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. May I offer my thanks to the leader of the Labour Party for uniting the Conservative backbenchers yeah. more effectively than any, anyone else could. And, um, may I thank him for reminding us of our democratic mandate, and may I ask the leader if we could have a debate on that issue. My honourable friend raises a very important point about the democratic mandate and what mandate do we have? Because most of us know that we are elected because of the party that we support. All the studies have shown that the personal vote that members of parliament have is remarkably small. And people are aware that however much independents may be brilliant individuals, they very, very rarely get elected to this House. It is the party ticket that gets people elected. And I know that bills have been introduced to this House in the past, supported by honourable members from across the House, particularly ones, I believe, from Berry, on having a by-election if people were to decide to change party. And I think this is something that it is worth discussing and debating, because the mandate goes with the party, but also, if I may say so, with the individual. Because members of the Conservative Party know that we were elected because of the leadership of our right honourable friend, the Prime Minister. He has the mandate, he has the commission from the Queen, he had the support of the British people in 2019, and it is our responsibility to ensure that the government he leads is a success.